Hi, my name is Wesley Lawrence Curry II. I'm in Huntington, West Virginia. I am the second in Leviticus, the sacrifice of the second in the manor, and I am the second in Zephaniah, the howling of the second. I am the little book in Revelation that John on Patmos was told to not write on paper, and I am the little scroll covered in lamentations and woe, living in Huntington and in the book of Ezekiel. I read only the King James Version of the Bible. I do not read any other version or any other scripture for words from God. The 144,000. The 144,000 in scripture are the fish gate, the 12 tribes of Israel, the remnant, the government of Israel. Who are the 144,000 in down-to-earth terms? Are they adults? None. Not one of the 144,000 is a grown adult. They are all young children whom never watch TV. They do not even speak to their own parents. They speak only the words Jesus Christ from the Holy Spirit gives them to utter. And here are the words that the 144,000 spoke. Bad boom, boom, mark of the ten, the black, death, war, yavol, hell. For Jesus put in scripture, I shall give no more any flattering divination within the house of Israel, nor vain vision. So here's the meaning of the prophecies. And these meanings, Jesus has shown all of you in visions and dreams. Bad boom is the wheel in the middle of the wheel the color of barrel. Boom is the fire enfolding in itself, Ezekiel. Down to earth terms. The wheel in the middle of the wheel, the color of barrel, is a green Volvo station wagon with a nuclear bomb built into it. That four engineers whom I have met shall park in the Twin City Marina Towers in Chicago and detonate. The fire enfolding in itself is the detonation of that nuclear device. That bomb is the judgment of Jesus Christ against you. For you all have seen Jesus seven times. He returned. He said, tell the vision. On August 25th, 2005, Jesus appeared to you and told you, tell the vision. On November 5th, 2005, Jesus Christ in the Holy Ghost spoke to you on February 22nd, 2006, and told you a commandment, tell the vision. He appeared to you again and said, tell the vision and you shall not need the mark. He appeared to you again and said, tell the vision and you shall heal without money. And no one said anything about it. And he appeared to you and said, no time to talk, Allah. And lastly, on November 21st in 2020, he appeared to you the seventh time in the return of Jesus Christ. In the seventh time, Jesus appeared to you, he said, you want war. It is that Jesus that I pray to, and I pray to no other. It is that Jesus that gave the 144,000 the prophecies, bad boom and boom, the wheel in the middle of the wheel, a nuke in Chicago, and the fire unfolding in itself, the explosion of that nuclear device. And hell begins that day. That is the day Jesus shall cast Satan out of the sky and put him on the earth in the flesh 
And from that day, the seven-year clock of hell shall begin ticking, and you shall all be imprisoned in hell. Hell. One-third of mankind shall die of the fires. One-third of mankind shall die of the diseases. Begins the day the nuke in Chicago detonates. Begins the day the wheel in the middle of the wheel, the color of barrel, makes the fire enfolding in itself. I'll go into this more in another video. Mark of the Ten. In the Torah, in the Old Testament, the Lord shall smite thee with the blotch of Egypt, the emerid and the itch and the scab. The mark of the ten is the blotch of Egypt. The mark of the ten is the abomination of the desolation. The mark of the ten is the mark of the beast. The mark of the ten is the image of of the beast. The mark of the ten is the 666. The mark of the ten is the Omni Bar. The Omni Bar is the blotch of Egypt, the abomination of the desolation, the mark of the beast. The Omni Bar shall be branded by handheld lasers, burned into the skin of the lunatics whom take it. The Omnibar comes with the emerald, free money, $32,523. That money is the city of Babylon that Jesus shall fall. That money shall fail. But all who take it in the initiation of that evil thing get an account an electronic money account of $32,523. You can't tithe that money. You can't spend it freely. It is in a computer. You can't loan it to your friends. It's not free money. Mark of the Ten, the Omnibar. Law shall be passed. When you go to a grocery store, if you do not have the Omnibar, you shall be turned away by armed military men. They shall, with guns, tell you you cannot go into the store to buy groceries. I don't care if you're starving to death. You can't go in. No mark, no entry. Trump shall pass a law that requires you to be branded with a barcode. The mark of Satan is that barcode. And without it, you can't spend your money freely. That is the mark of the ten. The black. One of the prophecies of the 144,000 given to them by Jesus Christ. The black is the itch and the scab. The noisome, bothersome sore. Jesus hates the Omnibar. He hates it greatly. And only those who take the Omnibar shall get a skin disease. It will look like dead patches of dark gray skin underneath their dermal layer. Gray scabs shall appear on their faces and on their loins and their chests and their arms and legs. The black is the noisome, bothersome sore, the itch and the scab that all who take the Omnibar shall be given by Jesus. For Jesus hates the Omnibar, the mark of the beast. Most of you shall take the 32,523 and be branded with the laser hand, with a handheld laser brander, with a barcode on your right hand, wrist, or forehead. Most of you shall take the mark of Satan. You shall be married to Satan at that time. Many, many who take the mark of the beast shall say, 
Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. This $32,000 is a blessing from Jesus. It's a blessing from God. This is good. Oh, this is wonderful. This is this is a miracle. Jesus is giving us $32,000. All we have to do is get that little barcode. Those people are evil and liars and perverters and none of them believe Jesus is God. They use his name for money. So we have bad boom, boom, mark of the 10, the black, death. What is death? Death is the wages of sin. Death is the desolation. Death is the kingdom of Gog and Magog. Death is the spirit of slumber. Death is the ashes inside of every one of your souls. Jesus one night sent an angel to lift your head as you slept and removed the scales from your eyes, allowing you to see the Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit of Jesus, the Elohim, the Jewish light in your belly. That light is the vision of the valley, Jesus told you to tell. And he showed you the, 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 the repercussions for your sins and non-repentant ways, for your lies and your murders and your thieveries. And for all the wicked things that you do, they are dead ashes in your soul, your foundation, your mansion, dead ashes, death. The black shall reveal the death in the skin of all who take the mark of the ten. Yavol. Yavol is the enforcers of the mark of the beast. Yavol is the enforcers of the Omni Bar branded barcode. War. You war against Jesus now. One of the most perverted, shameless acts in your war is when I hear you frauds say, we wait for Jesus to return. He did. You all know it. And saying we wait for Jesus to return is war against Jesus. Everyone in every pulpit, in every synagogue and church on earth who does not stand up and bravely say Jesus appeared to them saying tell the vision every one of those is an antichrist a fraud a liar those that call themselves apostles that are not apostles bad boom boom mark of the ten the black death Yavol, war, hell. The prophecies that Jesus Christ, whom said it is time, gave to the 144,000 all young children, virgins whom never watch TV. I am a teacher. I am not a prophet, but I am given the anointing from Jesus Christ. And in it, the gift to discern, the gift to speak and interpret every language known to mankind. Oh, about that nuclear bomb in Chicago in the green Volvo station wagon. I did see it, not in a dream, not in a vision. In real life. In Chicago. And I met the four men, the engineers, whom designed and built it. And I invited and welcomed two FBI agents into my apartment here and gave them every last bit of information I know concerning them. I was told by the FBI agents to not speak of this unless it impede their investigation. 
that was several years ago. So I'm going to tell you anyway. I've seen it. It's real. Not in a dream. I saw it on the street. I met the men that built it. I saw the device that is going to start the domino war of nuclear bombs and hell begins. One other huge detail. Jesus hates the Omnibar. All who take the mark of the beast, the branded barcode, the Omnibar, all who get the city of Babylon, the Emirate, the free $32,523 from the Arab oil banks in electronic money. Jesus shall kill them worldwide, publicly, in a moment's time. On a day, Jesus shall say this to all taking the mark of the beast, the Omnibar. Depart from me. I never knew you. And everyone with the Omnibar shall fall dead in the streets. How is it that Jesus shall kill them? He shall remove the vision of the valley, the Holy Spirit of Jesus, from your bellies. The pearl of light in your soul is the Holy Ghost. He shall remove it from all who take the Omnibar, and they shall fall dead that day. More on that next time. My name is Wesley Lawrence Curry II. Thank you for watching.